And that is where I rest my case. I think he's guilty. The jurors have jurored and come to the conclusion that the defendant is innocent. Order! I overrule thee! This man is clearly guilty. Take him away! Hello and welcome. Today, I'm gonna share with you the story of the great Judge Johnson. Hey. Who needs a jury when you got intuition like me? I am innocent, you see. My evidence is flawless. Why is it so dark in the juror room? I don't know. Maybe it's because we couldn't think of a funnier way to do the jury. Well, he's literally holding a sword in the courtroom. It's probably nothing, though. Maybe, but we can't just let him get away with it. Then what could we get him away with? Did you not hear me say that he's holding a sword? Oh yeah, right. We should probably lock him up. Lock him lock up. Lock him up. Lock him up. Lock him up. I overrule thee again. This man is innocent. I'm literally holding a sword. How did he not see that? Isn't it poetic how one slip-up is all it takes to return to Ash? This man is literally holding a sword. How did I not see that? I guess I'm as good as dead now. I really should have listened to the jury. My intuition was wrong. But how can it be? Yeah, I would have listened to the jury if I were you. That's where the story ended for the great Judge Johnson. But it doesn't have to end there for you. When someone gives you advice, at least consider it. Don't ignore it like the judge. With all said, you know all the YouTube things, but most importantly, don't get stuck in a glacial deposit. Goodbye.